The company Blackview is known for producing all sorts of budget phones, but their rugged devices series is one of the most popular on the market. The reason for that is the company manages to find a good balance between design, rugged properties, great specifications, and of course the price. My name is Linus and here is my review of the Blackview BV9000 Pro. Just before we start, the phone costs about 300 bucks. All the links, including the camera samples, will be down below in the video description. The phone ships with all the usual items, and some extras include a screen protector, a pair of earphones, USB ODG cable, 3.5mm to USB Type-C adapter, and the micro USB to the USB Type-C adapter. It is obvious that the BB9000 Pro is a rugged phone since it is thick and heavy but I have to say that this is one of the best designed and well built rugged phones, just like my previously reviewed Blackview rugged devices. The build quality is just excellent as the phone uses mostly metal and rubber in its construction. I love some extra features like a highly customizable smart key. We now have 18 by 9 aspect ratio display that I found to be pretty sharp and vibrant both indoors and outdoors. The phone has the IP68 rating meaning that it is water and dust resistant. Also the rugged body assures that the phone will survive a few accidental drops. Unlike the BV8000 Pro, there are flaps that cover the parts to avoid water damage. Just above the display we have an 8 megapixel shooter for selfies. It is great that we have a multi-color and customizable LED notification light. Gone are the capacitive keys, which are now implemented on the screen. As for optics, we now have a dual camera setup that I will cover a little bit later in this review. You can now access two SIM card slots and the microSD card slot easier. You don't need to remove the backplate like on a previous generation model. I found the fingerprint scanner to be quite accurate, even though the display could light up a little bit faster. Unfortunately, there is no headset jack, but the sound quality via the supplied adapter is pretty good. Finally, the loudspeaker is one of the loudest I've ever heard on any phone, and the quality is quite good, but the sound could be more balanced. When it comes to hardware, the Blackview BV9000 Pro is one of the most powerful budget rugged phones out there. The gaming performance is just great. All the 3D games work without any issues even if you play them on the very highest graphics settings, which is very impressive for a budget phone. Finally, I didn't notice any overheating issues. As far as user interface goes, we are looking at a heavily customized Blackview skin that is built on top of Android 7.1. I'm glad that this time around they kept the app tray and there are customization options and extra features. You can customize the navigation bar, LED notification light, use some gesture controls that work fine and choose from quite a few fingerprint gestures if you wish so. Overall, it would have been nice to have Android 8 out of the box, but I'm happy with the day-to-day -day performance as the phone is really fast and smooth even after installing plenty of apps. The overall image quality is pretty good even if you take pictures on a cloudy day like I did. Sure, some of the shots could be more detailed, but at the end of the day, this is still a budget phone and I'm happy with the results. The portrait shots are also surprisingly good in comparison to most of the budget Chinese phones I've recently tested. The night image quality, however, does not really impress. On a positive note, selfies taken with that 8 megapixels camera look pretty good. I'm recording a video in 4K resolution with a Blackview BV9000 Pro. The phone can shoot videos in 4K and 1080p. The 4K video quality does not really impress as it could be much more detailed. There are also quite a few video artifacts going on and there is no continuous autofocus. 720p selfie video quality could be better and the sound recording quality is just awful.
I didn't have any connectivity issues with this device, as the call quality and signal reception were pretty good, and even the GPS lock speeds and accuracy were okay. The phone has quite a few sensors including a gyroscope, so you'll be able to use this phone with VR headsets. The Blackview BV9000 Pro ships with a built-in 4180mAh battery that performs just great. I could constantly get over 7 or 8 hours of screen on time, but your mileage may vary, depending on the usage. Finally, the phone ships with a fast charger that can fully charge the phone in about 1.5 hours. The Blackview BV9000 Pro is a great looking and well crafted device that was built with the power users in mind who usually work in harsh weather and environmental conditions. The phone is very fast on the daily basis, it can handle most of the 3D games, daylight image quality is pretty good and the battery life is just great. However, the phone lacks the headset jack and the video and audio recording quality could be better. I still believe that the Blackview BV9000 Pro is one of the most powerful and one of the best budget rugged phones out there, despite a few shortcomings. But what do you guys think about this phone? Drop me a comment down below and as always if you like the video please hit the like button and please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Finally, for all the latest and greatest Chinese tech news and reviews, please visit gizmachina.com. It was Linus, thank you for watching and see you soon.